This title thanks to our sponsors, Customize It. We meet our blue corner firstly. She weighed in at 59 kilos, even making her debut tonight. She works as a trainee hydro control technician. Whatever that is. Fighting out of Ignite MMA, please welcome Christina Relo. Her opponent with a black belt in karate fighting out of the red corner, weighed in at 61 kilos last night. She's been training under the Wimp to Warrior program. Please welcome Carla McDonald. Kyokushin black belt. Expect some head kicks and some body punches. And Kia Melody is our referee round one. Both girls' favorite sub is the rear naked choke. Nice. Oh, wow. What a combination. <laughs> Both girls landing solid hands just then. Exchanging leg kicks and just exchanging punches, hands down. <laughs> Carla, definitely. <laughs> Vandalay uh, Silver Brian Stan <laughs> style. <laughs> Carla using the cage with that underhook. Knee to the body there. It's close. I'd like to see Carla push away. Oh, Throw some more of those punches. Here we go. They look like they're laser accurate. Switching stances. This is where you got to take a breath. It's only been a minute. Nice push kick. Christina just taking it in. Chin's high though. Solid connections with those punches there. We've got double, Carla with double unders, good reversals. Got Christina pressed up against the cage. Looking for the double. Christina standing very high there. You really want to pop your hips. Yep, yeah, that's it. Nice. Out the, framing away, circling off. Just enough time for Carla to get her kind of bearings back. She took some hard shots. What a great fight. Got a minute left. Nice. Another knee. Nice control, double unders. Looking for an outside trip. Oh, this finishes it well, nicely. Bit of cage grabbing there. She's almost fallen into a head and arm choke if she moves her right arm. Looking to pass the guard here. Using a bit of pressure, staying low. Definitely in danger of that guillotine. The punch to the head on the ground, just on the bow. Also not allowed if you are on your back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty solid connection too, but she seems alright. Yeah. Oh, the old cheeky hammer fist. Uh, hat. No, sometimes you just can't have yourself. You're always, no, you're always allowed one warning half the time. Yeah. I'm, I'm impressed. I'm impressed with Christina. Both girls actually like. Um, I'm impressed. Well, I'm impressed with both of them, but the, the power coming from just a couple of straight punches from Carla is really. But then uh, you know, Christina returning back. It's just been like a seesaw. You know, so that was a, uh, that's that's probably my favourite round of the of the show, just right there. So Especially when we're talking about the quality of punches that are just connected. Yeah, they, they were laser. Just a so that's that, that's that karate. Just that she needs to bring her hands back though. 
in the karate style and they come out straight with power but you need to bring your hands back from where they came from protect that face Nice and straight, straight down the pipe. That leg kick solid. Gotta have those hands up. Yeah. Wow. See those? They're wobbling. What a fight we've got here. She's got some mongrel in there, doesn't she, Carla? Yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah. They're both, they're both rocking each other, knocking each other, like kind of dazing each other and knocking each other back, back conscious. Nice. Decent ground game as well. She knew when to cross over. Let's see if she goes for uh, a submission here at all. Christina needs to work now on her hip escape. She needs to turn in, push on the knee. She doesn't have to worry about the punches, so just bring your elbows to your side, hip escape, get back to some kind of half guard, work from there. And training under Ryan Dunstan, I'm sure she's got a very good half guard. Nice sweep. You know, that's how you know a, tr a true friend, you know, what's your favourite guard? It's like asking someone what their favourite colour is. I know, I know Ryan loves his half guard. Kick to the liver by Carla. Christina needs to come forward now with the hands. She needs to. So Christina's proven that she can take these punches. As a coach, are you screaming out for her to avoid them? Obviously, you, you don't want to lose a round by taking those punches. No, but I think that's how they're, they're both. They've both got the same game plan. Just slightly punches. different styles, yeah. And it's just the down the. Wow, nice head kick. She's getting loose now. That's two head left head kicks. Okay, that one wobbled Christina. She needs to just get, she needs to circle and get away. She needs to clear, clear her head. She needs to keep moving. She doesn't have to exchange here. She's got 30 seconds left. She can just move, use the cage. Throw a few push kicks out. Nice, Superman. Hands up. Wow, solid. Carla's impressive. Yeah, I, I like the the fight IQ on on Carla here. So she's you know getting getting to that last minute, looking for the takedown. Okay. That's how that's how you win rounds. They will walks back to a corner like a boss. Now the first round, the striking going both ways. Carla gets the takedown. Second round, striking a bit more towards Carla, but she gets a takedown. You know, they're, they're just not just just notching up rounds. You know, effective striking, grappling, and then everything else after that. So you know, the striking is going backwards and forwards, but uh, you know, the grappling is going to Carla. But I'm not a judge. I had Ken Rig winning two of those rounds at least. Take us down. Be interesting to see if Christina can solve the riddle here. Final round for the girls. Seems like Carla's getting more and more confident the, the longer the fight goes. See if she goes back to that high kick. She's not overusing it, so she's being smart with it. Sometimes when you've got a good head kick, um, you know, it's easy just to keep whipping it out there like John claude Van Damme movie. You need to kind of leave it, sit on it. Christ Christina's had some... Uh, Landed some good shots in this round. Would you like to see her stop moving backwards? Maybe uh, move forward a little bit more? Hands up 
Definitely, I think she needs to work, push that jab out there. Start just popping it out there, popping it out there. Well, it's almost like she's listening. Just keep popping it out there. Just keep popping it out there and then throw her right. Put her right behind it. Just pitter patter. She doesn't need to knock her out with every punch. Just needs to get her going backwards. Because when she's when Carla's going backwards, she's going back with her chin up. No, yes. She needs space. She needs space. And that's that's Carla coming back with the takedown. She needs to sprawl here. Here we go. Right in front of us. Got about a minute and 30 to work here. Yeah, halfway through the last round. Again, the women just showing that they know how to fight. And just from the opening bell, these two, these two just being cracking each other in the head. And neither I'd one. See, I'd love to see. I was going to say, I'd love to see the accuracy uh, percentages with these punches that they're throwing. Early on, it was high. There's been a, a, they've been swinging a little bit for the fences. That's where I'd like to just see a bit more pitter patter, miss. You know, alternate timing, mistiming of the punches. So a couple of, couple of soft and then a few fast ones in there just to try to catch them off guard. Thirty seconds to go, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, make some noise! Both girls just giving each other a nod. They know they're going to. Uh throw some leather in this last 30 seconds. Oh, head kick. So close. The flexibility on Carla. I'm impressed with both girls. Fantastic. That was a great fight. Uh, I, I, I don't think I had a bunch of notes here. I didn't really get through. I didn't really get to go through them. Uh, Christina likes... Uh, Mountain bike riding and Impala. Well, she likes her fighting. She likes her karate. Well, she likes her karate. That's pretty much. It's pretty much evident right there. Everything's about the karate, the head kicks, body punches. Um, I'd like to see Carla. I'd like to see both these girls back in the cage. Definitely under B class rules. Um, they've had a little taste for it. Um, yeah. Probably at 57, I reckon Carla at both of these girls at 57, and uh, I think we've, we've got a bit of a flyaway division. You'd have to think Carla's taken that fight, but Christina, she's got to be happy. She's got a lot of good submission, uh, sorry, a lot of good um, standing strikes, and she's got a lot well, of good combinations. Ladies and gentlemen, in. another cracker of Again, a fight here won. tonight at Winter Warrior at the Mansfield Tavern. Give it up for the two ladies, big round of applause. We go to the judges' scorecards after the three rounds. Unanimous decision goes to the red corner, Carla McDonald. As a fight fan, that was just enjoyable to watch as well. Especially for a f two first-time fighters. 